Hello everyone, in this video I'll be reviewing this dash cam by a brand called Ape Man, model number C550 and it got a very nice unique design to this. It comes with a front um, dash cam and it also has a real camera as well which has to be has, has to have a few wiring done before it goes to the back of the car. It comes with a car charger. Um, one downside about this straight away is that you know around this time or you know this generation when technology is adva advancing a lot it should have had at least micro usb charging port or the usb type c because they're a lot faster to charge more common now this has the old mini um um charging port and it, you know this is the one of the downsides that really put me off um but it has a lot of good features you take some micro sd memory card the reset button is here um, at the front, you got the power on button, uh, and obviously you ha it can also be it doesn't have to be connected to your charger constantly. Um, also, you can see that the quality of this is pretty good. Okay, I will do a, de a demo testing on a car, and you can see the quality when it records. Um, on you can see that it has um, quite a lot of um, like the resolution here. Where if you press it, hold on. So we got the format, the languages, the beep sound, the frequency, the power, auto power off, screen saver, day and time. Um, let me go back. So here, okay, here, you got 1080 FHD, 1020p or VJ. You can choose either one of them. Uh, so if you go down, you got display mode where it has a picture in, in picture, front camera, back camera, split screen. You got loop recording. It has WDR, exposure, motion detection, record audio, date stamp, G sensor, parking monitor. Which parking monitor is probably one of the best thing for a dash cam. Okay, it it basically stays on 24 hours on standby and if any kind of touch have happened on, on the car or anything it will automatically uh, activate and start recording so you know you can use that as evidence if you know if someone does hit your car at night or when you're not driving you're at home etc it has a li license plate number where you can put your license plate number as well it has a gps it has a speed unit so it got pretty good a lot of good features built into this at the top you got the AV in as well and G and GPS as well so the ports to put in here and you can also cont um, control this bit okay so you can see that you can adjust it the way you want it um, so so these are all the features that this product has and it has more features as well on top of all these things it has um, let me go in order okay it ha also has um, du a dual channel so front and, and rear with loop recording HDR motion detection G sensor and it also has enhanced night vision so at night time you can record like in good HD video um, on top of that it has 24 hours parking monitoring protection with emergency lock and loop recording it has wide angle and vision so front can record up to 170 de um, 70 degrees back can record up to 120 de degrees it has a full HD 1080p resolution, f1.8 um, wide aperture, um, MP4 video um, encoding. It supports 32 gig class 10 memory card, micro SD memory card with a two inch um, screen here. Okay, so that's all the features. Keep watching my video. I'll do the demo testing of how it operates. Okay, if it's very, if it operates very smoothly, and you will see it for yourself. Okay, this is being recorded in a 1080p resolution and what I'm seeing right now, this is how it's capturing it. Okay, so I'm going to do a, a demo and test drive with it and see how smooth um, the dash cam is. <laughs> 